In Edge Elastic, first you create a class and save it, and then you add the students. You can create a class in three ways. Start at the dashboard and select Create a New Class, or sync with Google Classroom if you have a Google Classroom set up. Or you can even go to Manage Class here or here, and this is where you can create or manage classes that you have already created. The first way is to create a class manually. To create a class manually, select Create New Class from the dashboard. You'll be prompted to enter class information. You'll enter the name, grades, subjects, and standard sets. If you wish, you can choose to fill out the course or add a tag, something like English 2, Course 310, or Algebra. I've added the tag here, DCA, so when my admin goes to assign an assessment, they can find my class easily by searching for DCA. The information you input in this class information is vital. Admin use it to find your classes and your data, and it ensures proper standards alignment in your standards gradebook. I'm going to go ahead and fill out the information as needed. Now, I'll click Save Class and I'm ready to add students. Another way to create a class is by using Google Classroom. If you use Google Classroom, this is the simplest way to set up your class. Because I've already created a class here, I no longer have my Sync with Google Classroom icon. What I'll need to do is go to that Manage Class icon I mentioned previously, and once there, select Sync with Google Classroom at the top right. I'll need to choose the account in which I'm syncing my Google Classroom from, sign in as needed, and then follow the prompts to choose my classes. For example, if I only want my fourth grade class to be synced, I'll go ahead and remove all of these classes and then fill out the information as needed. Again, you'll want to be sure to fill out this class information correctly. Now, I'll go ahead and click import. Your roster will automatically be imported and you are ready to begin assigning. For those of you that are not Google Class users and have created your class manually, visit the next video to learn how to add students.